my name is Paika Denis Pasha. Uh, we are here today to hear the judgment of the military court uh, on the case of uh, Haluk Selam Tufanne. Uh, he refused to do the reserve, reserve services, uh, declaring his conscientious objection. Uh, and he's being tried on uh, not joining them, on disobeying the orders. Um, uh, throughout the trial, there has been many occasions that whether he's a real conscientious objector was uh, uh, questioned many times. Uh, when he stated the sexist nature and the violent nature of the army and the reasons uh, that led to his decision, especially what he has seen through the army process, including oppression uh, in human treatment of of people from, uh, doing their compulsory service. This has been mocked. It, it's, it's been a very long trial. Uh, this has not been taken seriously by the Attorney General's office, whose real duty should be actually uh, to protect the rights of the people. He's, he should not act as he is now as the um, as the lawyer of the army. And, and now we're hearing the final judgment. Um, of course, we're all afraid that um, this may entail imprisonment. Uh, in a very similar case of Murad Khan Ali, he was, uh, or he was ordered that he pays a fine of 500 tele, uh, which is around 200 euros, or uh, uh, goes to prison for 10 days. And what we say is that we're not going to give any, any penny or, or any set, we don't have even a penny or a second to give to the army. And of course he did not pay it and he was uh, sent to the prison. Uh, regarding Haluk's case, we don't know. Um, we're hopeful that maybe uh, Due to the pressure from the public for the recognition of the right to conscientious objection, um, it may be different. Uh, we will see. <laughs> there has been many discussions, uh, especially in front of the public, but the right to conscientious objection actually never went to the parliament. And what they have been, uh, what what was suggested by some uh, of the MPs was um, alternative service, but within the armed. Uh, armed powers within the army, which is unacceptable to us, but it did not even uh, turn into a formal suggestion uh, to add a new article. And the whole draft uh, changes to the uh, to the military code, to the law. Uh, they all then revolved around uh, lessening the period for compulsory uh, services. And it, it has passed just in that regard. They just, concerning some people, they have just shortened the duration of uh, compulsory services, but uh, in the General Assembly, it was not even brought uh, into attention the need to uh, recognize conscientious objection. And actually, this is also disregarding the law. Uh, in Murat's case, uh, when the case was taken to the Constitutional Court, the Constitutional Court stated that the European Convention of Human Rights is part of the it, it is part of the law that is applicable in northern part of Cyprus, and uh, they have cited the case law where European Court of Human Rights accepted that conscientious objection is uh, a part. It, it's a right that is covered by freedom of religion and thought. Um, but they they had stated that this, it is the duty of the parliament to change the law, and uh, uh, the, uh, the constitutional court did not find it unconstitutional. But in another way, they did in effect recognize the need to recognize the, the right to consensus objection. Well, um, if if the verdict is that he's guilty and then he's sent to prison, of course uh, we have already organized. Um, what to do. Uh, we, we will of course uh, go into the streets and protest about it and make make sure the public knows what's going on, that uh, people who refuse to kill, people who refuse to hold a gun, people who refuse to perceive uh, other people as enemies, the, what the ones in power tells us to do, people who does not want to take part in a sexist organization are sent to prison. We will make sure that public knows about it. And um, I believe that the conscience of the public uh, will not be so readily accept, uh, accepting the whole situation. I mean, we can see it, I guess, from the crowd that is 
uh, already present here. So in Jean Paul, I'm representing the Constantius object uh, Arup Seram to Bambi. Today, Arup sentenced to pay 500 Turkish euros for not joining the reserve service. Arup refused to join the reserve service because the Constantius object. Uh, the court uh, expressed that there is no law which protects the Constantius objectors.